CoQ10 and Parkinson's disease. Hi, I'm Dr. James Machino. You know, in the year 2002, published in the Archives of Neurology, Dr. Clifford Schultz proved that coenzyme Q10 supplementation slows the progression of Parkinson's disease very significantly in human subjects that had Parkinson's. The problem is that many neurologists still don't pass this information along to patients. So where did Dr. Schultz even get the notion that CoQ10 could be helpful in Parkinson's patients? Well, he noticed that Parkinson's patients had very low blood levels of coenzyme Q10. And in animal studies, he saw that CoQ10 supplementation prevented the disease in animals who were predisposed to it. And th uh, therapeutic doses helped to manage the disease in animals that developed the problem. So he then tested it on humans and he saw that it works for patients with Parkinson's. So how does it work? Well, CoQ10 is required for energy production in the part of the brain that is affected by Parkinson's disease. That part of the brain is known as the substantia nigra. And in that part of the brain, you have to make dopamine. And if you don't have enough energy, because there's not enough CoQ10, because CoQ10 is required for energy, you can't make enough dopamine. And it's the lack of dopamine synthesis that is responsible for most of the Parkinson's symptoms, especially in the early stages. And then without CoQ10, you're also missing an important antioxidant in that part of the brain. And so the free radicals that build up tend to damage the nerve cells, and nerve cells eventually die. And now this leads to the progression of the disease, which can be very, very severe. So what does coenzyme Q10 supplementation do for a Parkinson's patients? It, it gives them, it gives that part of the brain the, the CoQ10 it needs to make energy. And with that energy, the brain can make more dopamine to help to decrease the Parkinson's symptoms. And CoQ10 is an important fat-soluble antioxidant. Guess what? The brain is made largely out of fatty material. And so in that fatty, waxy medium, that's where CoQ10 is outstanding at mopping up free radicals before they can do damage and kill nerve cells. So it's, it's remarkable what CoQ10 can do in Parkinson's disease. Now, I explain all the details of this in Chapter 5 of my book called The Machino Optimal Living Program, Seven Steps to a Healthy, Fit, Age-Resistant Body. And you can download that chapter for free at the link below, and I think you should. It explains all the research in this area, what dosage you should consider to prevent Parkinson's, if a person has Parkinson's disease, what dosages have been proven to be useful. It's really a must-read for anyone with Parkinson's disease, or if the disease runs in your family. You want to know what you can be doing now, possibly, to help prevent it. Now, machinohealth.com, you'll see my other research review papers, you'll see footage from my live professional seminars, other downloads and resources and videos I've created. They're all there for free to help you lead a long, healthy, functional life. All my research review papers and teaching materials are complete with all the scientific references, so you'll see you're getting only evidence-based information from me on any health topic that you're looking for. So you should use machinohealth.com as an ongoing, reliable resource of health and wellness information for both you and your family. Thanks so much for watching.